<laughs> the Derby has come to heyday. Now you and your neighbors can challenge other neighborhoods to a friendly, spirited horse race. And they're off. With the Neighborhood Derby, you can collaborate with neighbors and receive rewards together. Each horse in the Derby represents a neighborhood. To move your horse ahead, you and your neighbors must complete various tasks. Participate in the Derby by joining a neighborhood. Tap on the Derby stand near your neighborhood house to reveal what the feature has to offer. Derbies last for seven days, starting at the same time for all neighborhoods. Once the Derby ends, a new one will begin right away. In this first tab, you will see a selection of tasks. Tasks range from harvesting a particular amount of crops, to completing boat orders, serving visitors in your town, fishing at the lake, and so on. Each of your neighbors has a chance to complete an equal number of tasks. Look through the tasks. At the right side of the window, you'll see how many items you must collect or actions to perform. You'll see a time limit, and how many points the task will yield. Then to select one, how about we harvest some corn? Keep in mind, items purchased through Tom or the roadside shop do not count. Notice a little counter has appeared on the right side of my farm. This indicates how much corn I've collected so far, which is zero, and how many I still need in order to complete the task, so 55. Now I have completed my first task. That leaves four more tasks on my personal quota. When you finish all your tasks, you may purchase one additional task to complete. I'll go ahead and select a new task, the bacon task. If you cannot complete a task, you can trash it. However, this will leave you with fewer turns to contribute to the race. As I wait for bacon, let's continue getting to know the derby feature. The racetrack tab has been unlocked now that I have a task selected. Here I can see how my neighborhood is doing so far in the race. Check out all the neighborhood horses vying for the first place trophy. Your neighborhood's horse will always appear at the top. The points you and your neighbors receive from completing tasks will move your racehorse forward. By reaching the blue flag checkpoints, you and your neighbors are awarded horseshoes. Horseshoe prizes can only be collected after the derby ends. My neighborhood and I will complete this derby and show you how rewards are gathered. The derby is ended and my neighborhood reached first place. Now I can claim my winnings. We were able to reach three checkpoints so I can collect just as many prizes. I can choose one reward from each column. Sweet! Prefer a different selection of rewards? You can shuffle the choices for a new set of possibilities using diamonds. Note, you don't have to shuffle everything at once. You may keep certain items while shuffling the rest for a better chance at winning what you're looking for. I will select the two items I like and shuffle the rest. Time to choose. Hmm. Excellent. The last tab is for general feature information, as well as tutorials on completing tasks and collecting rewards. The Neighborhood Derby is a great way to earn awesome rewards and work as a team. Last but not least, if your neighborhood's horse makes it to the top three on the winner's podium, you can win extra personal prizes. Ride, horsey, ride!